These turning turbine blades convert the wind's energy into electricity. But to have it available when the wind isn't blowing, you need batteries. And normal rechargeable cells just don't do the trick. However, electricity can be used to create a gas fuel. And in that form, it can be stored in the regular gas grid. The gas grid is already a huge source of stored energy. In Germany, we have over 200,000 kilometers of natural gas pipelines, big ones and small ones. If we can use this infrastructure to store power to gas, it would be a big step. We could store all kinds of renewable energy and transport it as well. A device known as an electrolyzer will be built here. It's the key to converting wind power into gas fuel. It uses electricity to split water into hydrogen and oxygen. This plant will one day be the biggest power-to-gas plant in all of Europe. It could become a prototype for industrial applications. Electrolyzers are usually used for other applications. They're seldom produced, especially for this power-to-gas process we have here. So they're real niche products that can be pretty expensive. We're developing a technology here to eventually lower the costs. Experts say power-to-gas has a promising future once it becomes cheaper. Researchers say that could be in 10 years. They're part of a joint effort by scientific institutions and business to explore the technology's potential. There are lots of pilot projects where we're learning how we can make improvements and technical adjustments. That's why I think costs will soon come down. Insiders say there will have to be some regulatory changes before such power plants are really attractive investments. At the moment, they're taxed like conventional power plants, even though the power is not really consumed, but merely converted into another form. At the moment, we're seen as end consumers, as a hydrogen producer. That means we have to pay all kinds of taxes and fees as an energy user. And the answer to when that will change is blowing in the wind. In the meantime, all the excess energy produced by wind turbines simply goes to waste.